up with Adam Werity. Do you remember Adam Werity? He was Dr Fox's friend. There he is. He gave an interview to The Spectator this week and, amongst other things, we found out what his plans are for New Year's Eve. So he's going to spend it with the foxes? <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> They're very he's... forgiving. Yeah. Is he a friend of Dr Fox's like um, William Hague had that friend? <laughs> <laughs> You should have a chat with our lawyer about that one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you spell innuendo? <laughs> You're doing countdown, you should brush up on these things. Oh. <laughs> Don't talk to me about that. Mike. No, well, well, have you done well? You would... I see all these letters. Yeah. I thought, oh my god. And I I said I I get cat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and then and then some kid yeah. says cataclysmic. Yeah. <laughs> There's only nine letters, isn't there? I don't know. No, no. <laughs> yes, he is indeed. Paul, you're right. He's going to be round at the Foxes. It's just staggering how naive some of these senior politicians can be. Isn't it? Mm. Staggering. <laughs> and then Cameron brings in Coulson into number 10. Sort of bloke you wouldn't have in the house. 